We've been all hearing about the state's budget problems these days. One way to create revenue could be a tax on groceries. Governor Lamont says it's one of many ideas and has certainly become quite a talker. Chief Capital reporter Susan Rapp is live at the state legislative office building in Hartford. And Susan, I know my Facebook page and Twitter filling up with people who don't like it. I would imagine so, and I think it's certainly become a talker, not only here at the state capitol, but even in grocery stores. It is something, however, that a few states are doing, not any states that are really close to New England, but it is successful in some of those states. They do put a sales tax on groceries, but it's not been talked about here in Connecticut. And some feel that if it is raised, it would have a tough time passing. A safer bet, legalized sports gambling. To be clear, there is no formal proposal for a grocery tax, a highly controversial idea strongly opposed by Republicans and Democrats. But Governor Lamont did ask his budget team to run the numbers on what a tax could generate. We have analyzed probably 1,000 different options. That's one of them, and it's not in the top 900 in terms of what we're planning to do. Another plan, not nearly as controversial, and one that's getting bipartisan support, legalized sports betting. Oh, I think it's here. You know, that train has left the station. Our neighbors are doing it, and I think uh, Connecticut's going to catch up and do it too. Other states like New Jersey are making millions. Ted Taylor from Sport Tech wants in on the action. People are starting to realize that we're actually a great solution if you look at the infrastructure that we've got. Sport Tech has locations across the state. This one is right next to Bradley Airport. They're established venues for off-track betting. Taylor says this is the right place for sports betting. The state's two tribes not only want in on the action, they want a monopoly, but not all lawmakers feel they should have one. The biggest challenges for the legislature will be to decide who gets to participate, and even trickier, online gaming, and how to control that. Sports betting, whilst it's happening already everywhere, it's not as big a margin as, say, a slot machine or the lottery or those types of things. But it's happening already, so really what we're talking about is just bringing it into a regulated legal environment. Sports betting has been brought up a few times before, but given the fact that the state faces some huge deficits, many feel that it has a very good chance of passing this year. As for some of these other proposals, like that much-talked-about grocery tax, we will know a lot more when Governor Lamont proposes his budget, which is expected to be revealed on the 20th of this month. We are live in Hartford, Susan Raff, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. All right, thank you, Susan.